Animated GIF files can be a helpful instructional tool. I'm going to show you how to find them and use them in your classroom. I'm going to start by performing a Google search. Just uh, uh, I teach science, so I'm going to look for a uh, science-related one. I'm just going to do a search for cell division. And I'm going to do an image search, so I'm going to click on images. And there's a lot of filters that we can apply here. So the first thing I'm going to do is click on tools. And that brings up a whole new row of options. Under the type selection, I'm going to filter my results to only show animated files. And that's going to reveal images, but when I click on them, they will show me that they're animated. These are images that have motion in them, otherwise known as animated GIFs. Now I want to use this in a Google Doc, so I'm going to right click on the image and select Save As. And I'll just uh, save that to my downloads folder for now. And then I'm going to go to my Google document, go to insert image, upload from computer, and select the image that I just saved. And it'll insert right into my document. Now you can't insert videos into a Google document, but because Google recognizes this as an image, not a video, it works great and it loops as you can see there. You can also insert animated GIFs into Google Forms. Here's an example that I created where I have um, an insert, an image of a, this is a process called crossover. So I insert my image and then I can ask a question below it. So there's a couple of ideas for using GIFs in your classroom.